Marshall University spent the morning and good part of the afternoon working on the seating over at Jonesy Edwards Stadium in preparation for the upcoming football season. 13 News reporter Steve Kirch tells us that the work that they did wasn't so much about the money, but about securing their futures after college. It's a bright sunny day in Huntington, and since 8 o'clock this morning, the ROTC students over at Marshall University have been installing seats for season ticket holders. Um, it just makes them comfort more comfortable for them to be here, um, gets them more excited for the game, lets them stay longer because they're not sitting on the hard bleachers. The stadium seats more than 38,000 people, and Ackerman says installing the padded seats with a drill and a lot of sweat is quite a workout. Out on a hot day like today. I get a lot of exercise. There's a lot of up and down the stairs. Uh, it's my cardio for the day. <laughs> and Taylor says that on a hot day in August, he is glad they got a big turnout. Uh, yeah, this is probably our biggest turnout so far. Last year, we kind of didn't have as many people, so it took us about a week to get everything installed. The ROTC students here at Marshall University are installing over 2,000 seats, but their work isn't entirely for free. They're getting something in return for it. And so the money that we get for this helps out with updated equipment, um, uniforms, stuff like that that we need to run the program. The ROTC program gets a donation from the athletic department for their service. The two have been partnering together for the past 20 years. Ackerman says that money helps grow the program so more students can secure jobs in the military after graduation. Um, it's also, we're guaranteed to have a job after graduation, which is a big thing for college students. Ackerman and some of the other students who volunteered on Sunday are contracted to become second lieutenants in the Army upon graduation. And she feels that students running up and down those stairs on a Sunday afternoon installing seats played a big part in it. Reporting from Huntington, Steve Kirch, 13 News, working for you. The ROTC program over at Marshall University.